I know you might hate me after watching this video, but I have to tell you the harsh reality. Welcome back to Nima Speaks, a place where I empower women throughout the diaspora. Remember, don't you know that a man being rich is like a girl being pretty? You might not marry a girl just because she's pretty, but my goodness, doesn't it help? With your host, Nima Speaks. Hey ladies, welcome back to Nima Speaks. Today I want to come back and talk to you about five signs that this man is wasting your time and he will never marry you nor commit to you, but you are letting him. Now ladies, I know this might be logical and straightforward video, but when women are in a relationship, we tend to have a habit of doing dumb things stuff okay we do dumb stuff that if you are outside of the relationship you would know exactly what to do so without further ado let's get started on the five red flag and sign that he will never commit to you let's go the first important sign slash red flag is that you are chasing him now ladies 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 i know most people have a problem with what i'm gonna be saying here right now but you all need to clean out your ears and hear me correctly if you notice that you are chasing a man so what do i mean that you're chasing a man for example you are always calling him he never initiate anything with you Okay, if a man does not go out of his way to initiate no contact with you and you always got to be the first one to chase him around, ladies, he's not going to commit to you. He will never put a ring on it. He will never marry you because he does not care enough for you. And I can hear a lot of people saying, oh, lies, lies, lies. Men are natural hunters. Men are love to work hard for everything in their life i don't care you ladies a woman rests in her femininity but men especially masculine men they love to chase when i say chasing it's not the dumb people say oh play hard to get blah 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 no no more initiating contact if you find yourself you're always checking your phone to see if this man is texting me blah 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 that means he'll never commit to you because he's not that into you i am sorry to break this to you harshly like this but you need to hear this right now okay if you go out of your way to make sure that this man is alive he hasn't talked to you in two weeks three weeks four weeks you're worried here sitting twiddling your thumb no just move on ladies why is this extremely important because if you are out here chasing this man everywhere that means that he is resting in his femininity well, you're going into your masculinity because masculine energy is a go-getter energy. So if you are running around chasing this man, that means your man is feminine. He's just sitting down being pretty while you are tapping into, while you are being masculine, trying to run hard and chase this man. If you'd like to know more my advice on this, go watch my video on the insane truth about pick me women why men never marry you while they waste your time why you are a pick me woman i'm gonna link that video up above go watch that video and you will know exactly what i'm talking about but what you have to remember if you're chasing him it means that he is not that into you because if a man love you if a man cares for you you will know you will not have to go chasing you will not have to go running around twiddling your thumb you will just know as the ladies we have a gut instincts that we know when a man love us we know that if you feel any of these signs that i'm going to be mentioning in a second this man will never marry you he'll never put a ring on it he'll never commit to you so ladies take the l move on if you feel confused, if you're in a relationship with a man, you feel confused, this man will never commit to you. He'll never marry you because relationships are not supposed to be extremely confusing. No, it's not supposed to be that. Or you are not sure if he is 
into you you're like is it into me no babes okay if you're questioning anything that means that no this man will never commit to you okay he wasted your time but right now you are letting him you gave him the power you allowed him to waste your time and i'm sorry i'm saying waste time and people will be sensitive and coming for me in the comment section but it's uh, the harsh reality you spend a two year three years with this man move on now get out of this relationship and move on so again the first sign that he will never commit to you he will never marry you he'll never put a ring on it is that you are always chasing him the second sign that this man he will never commit to you is that he is all hat but no kettles so if you're all from the south you know exactly what i'm talking about when i say all hat no kettle now my dad used to tell me all the time that if a man he's all hat and no kettle run for the hills so if you're not from the south or you don't know what the heck i'm talking about here when somebody says all hat no kettle is they're talking about people who talk the big talk but they never keep their promise if he does not keep his promise, that means that his words does not mean shiza. Ladies, he will never commit to you. I am sorry to break it to you. He's just wasting your time. One of the most important thing about human being is that a man words should be his dignity. Okay, but if he is all hat and no kettle ladies run for the heels when he says he'll do something but he does not and he has a long list of excuses and reason and oh my god this happened and that happened this is why i'm so sorry it, i didn't do it because oh my god i would this uh, he just have so much excuses and reason as into why he could not keep his words to you that is the red flag that is a sign that in the future in the near future if he's not gonna keep his promises about the little things in life can you imagine about the bigger issues can you imagine about bigger commitment that this man he will be able to keep his promises or is he just gonna remain all hat no kettle Okay, ladies, you got to ask yourself, and I'm sorry, I know this might sound so mean and rude, but it's extremely true. A man who does not keep by his words, he'll never marry you because he's playing games with you. He's wasting your time, babes. This is what you got to understand. I'm the messenger here. I want you to, ladies to do better. For example, when I say that he does not keep his promise, right? What exactly do I mean? Hmm? What exactly do I mean? Men are so simple. We as women, we try to complicate them, but men are extremely simple. When a man, he's into you and he will say he's going to do something and he's a man of his word, he's high value, he's affluent, he says he's going to do something he will do it but somebody who does not care how his words come to you he does not want to commit with you he just want to waste your time he's going to tell you that hey babes i'll call you tomorrow at two and then tomorrow at two he doesn't call you and you are all worried you're like oh my god oh my god he didn't call me he didn't call me so you start calling him and he's like oh my god oh my god i'm so sorry babe i totally forgot i was talking to my boys and then i fell asleep i'm so sorry and you're like back nima but he's just a call i know it's small but it's always started with little white lies little small signs that we forget and then it become a bigger lie i live by this saying this is my favorite saying that i have always lived by and my daddy taught me this okay y'all might hate me some people say oh i'm a gold digger i'm mean i'm rude i'm all of this but my daddy taught me this so go fight with my daddy but one of the quote that my dad he used to always tell me is that nima you are hard to get but you're easy to lose. My daddy taught me this to say to any man who is going to ever come in your life, they should know this, that you are hard to get. 
What does that mean? That means that they got to put effort to get you. But at the same time, it should be at the back of their mind that you are easy to lose. You have options. Okay. You have options options this is what i want you to understand so if this man is all hat no kettle just talk the big talk he does not keep his promises get out of there now he will never marry you he will never put a ring on you i'm sorry to break it to you but that's the harsh reality that you need to hear right now so the second important red flag that this man will never marry you he'll never commit to you is that he's all hat no kettle The third red flag that this man will never commit to you. And this ladies, I got to call you out on this one because we let them. Okay. We let them get away with so much. So the third one is that you need to have his social media accounts. You need to constantly check his phones because you don't trust him. Okay, ladies, they may be like Nima. How is this a red flag? How is this a sign that he'll never commit to you? Ask yourself. If you have to go through his phone to assure yourself that this man is only solely committed to you, how does that sound? Let's be clear here. How does that sound? That means that there is no trust in this relationship. He is a grown man. Why do women feel the need to have his men's social media account so they can check and see if they're talking to a woman or they can they need to have their phone password so they can go through their messages i have never in my life ask a man like can i see your phone so i can go through your message so i can see that you're not talking to anybody else first of all i sound desperate second of all i sound crazy Third of all, I'm telling you, I don't trust you. That's why I need to see everything. And this is a sign that if there is no trust in a relationship, ladies, that means that he will never commit to you. And this goes both ways. If he's asking you, he need to see your social media, he need to see your phone, your messages, your email, he need to have password to everything. First of all, we are not legally married. I'm sorry, I'm not a missus, so you don't need to see have all my password. And again, it's not you being defensive or him being defensive. It's all about trust. If you lack trust in a relationship, it's not gonna go far. Okay, I'm sorry, ladies. I am sorry. I have to tell you the truth. I'm, I know, I know, I know. I know you might hate me after watching this video. But I have to tell you the harsh reality. Right? And the harsh truth is that that's the truth. Right? If you're asking him, if you're going around searching to make sure you feel comfortable, that means that he doesn't trust you. Right? He doesn't trust you. He doesn't trust you. Oh, you don't trust him vice versa it doesn't matter so what should you do with that information you need to go ahead and move on this show there is no trust in the relationship so why should he commit to you ladies ask yourself if you're always bugging him let me see your phone let me see your phone that means deep inside at your gut you have a feeling that this relationship Mm, it's a waste of time but as ladies we like to go ahead and try to explain things and try to make things make sense we say so okay if i have his social media account that means that i can see everything that make me feel better no babes it won't make you feel better what you gotta do is you gotta go on pack your things and off you go it's hard to hear i know i know i know it's mean for me to say this but I have, I have to call you out. I have to call you out. So if you have your men's social media password and you're going through there looking for trouble, and this is what my grandma told me. If you go around poking the bear, looking for trouble, trouble is going to come. We all know this. If you are always looking for trouble, trying to look for red sign, because our brain are such a powerful tool. Our brain has such a great imagination and has a, such a great focus if we focus on something for too long it's gonna manifest and come 
true. So again, ladies, the third most important. This is extremely important, right? If you're looking at his social media, there is no trust in the relationship. He'll never commit to you. He'll never marry you. So what you gotta do, babes, take the L. Take the L and move on. And if you wanna learn more, watch my video on why men love biatches. Because biatches are secure. They're not insecure. They know who they are. They set their standard. I'm gonna leave that video up above. Go watch a why men love biatches. How to go from a doormat to a dream girl. But this is extremely important. The third point is that you don't have trust in the relationship. He'll never commit to you because you know it. He knows it. Just go ahead and call it off. The fourth sign to know that if this man is wasting your time is that you're his dirty little secret. Okay, I'm going to repeat that one more time. This man, he is wasting your time your precious time and you're allowing him to waste that time is if you're his dirty little secret. Now y'all may sit there and say, Nima, can you explain? Can you elaborate? What exactly do you mean I am his dirty little secret? He will give you a reason as into why you cannot meet his family, friends, and the people that cares for him. Now, maybe like Nima. Okay, maybe I don't want to meet his family. Why is that a red flag? Ladies, let me ask you something. When you're in a relationship, right? When you're excited, when you love somebody and you want to commit and marry this person. Are you the type of person who think, I want to keep this little secret to myself and I don't want nobody else to know? Think about it, ladies. When you are in love with somebody and I know people are different true right but if you have been dating for six months nine months a year two years three years and i don't recommend you to date people for over three years if you haven't watched my live stream married women panel most of those women they said they got married within one month to six months okay ladies they knew they're gonna marry them and they proposed to them don't be dating people over two three four seven ten a hundred years no, he doesn't need that much time. Man knows. Let me get back to the topic of you being his dirty little secret. Think about it, ladies. When you're excited about something or you met a new guy, what is your first instinct? You want to tell the whole universe. You want to tell everybody. So if he keep you hush hush, ladies, can you put two and two together? That means... Either he's embarrassed to be with you or somebody can argue that it's anima, but maybe he's a private person. Even introverted people and private people, they'll talk about you to somebody. They'll want to share with you with his, their friends. You may say, Nima, maybe he has a toxic family. No, let's not excuse. You have never even met his friends. That's a sign. That's a sign that he's keeping you his dirty little secret. And what another sign that you're his dirty little secret, right? He only want to go out with you. No weekends. He's telling you, no weekends. I go to my mom. I have to visit my mom every single weekend. Mm -hmm. Or he doesn't want to sing by with you during the day. He want to go on dates when it's like 7 p.m. at night in the dark. So nobody can question him. I'm just, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, I'm just letting you know. And if you ask him, babes, when can I meet your friends, right? Or when can I meet your family or something like that? And I don't recommend you going ahead and asking men, like, can I meet your family? Can I meet your friends? Like, ew, no, you sound desperate. Men are so simple. When a man truly want to commit to you, he loves you, he cares for you. You don't have to worry. You don't have to jump through hoops and start thinking about this and this and this and this and that. Oh my God, does he love me? He will let it known. Men are prideful people. They want to claim you. They want to put their imprint on you and say, this is mine. Back off. Everybody back off. It's mine. I know, I know, I know. Yeah, I might roll your eyes and say, Nima, but we're not properties. Well, uh, babes, nobody cares. Nobody cares. Okay, I'm sorry. Just telling you like how it is. Masculine alpha male, they are extremely protective. 
they would want the whole universe to know that this girl she's mine she's my girl i'm his she's mine vice versa and you you better back off so i'm gonna be telling my friends and everybody and their mama and i don't expect men to be sitting here gossiping about you If none of my previous four red flags and signs, you're like, Nima, I still don't believe it. If none of those points hit home, this fifth one, this one is about to shatter you. So open up, be ready, hear this. So the fifth reason, the fifth sign, the fifth red flag, whatever you want to call this. As in to why your man will never marry you. He will never put a ring on you. He will never commit to you. He's wasting your time and you are letting him is if you're watching this video. I'm sorry. I know, I know, I know. I know you hate me now. Didn't you just want to hate me? I know, ladies. I am so sorry to break it to you. If you're watching this video, especially if you search for this video, sis. You already know he's wasting your time. You already know he will never commit. I know. Okay, let's have a sister to sister, a girl to girl, a woman to woman. I don't know what you want to call me. I'll be a big sister, a little sister, your medium sister. Let's have it. If you're watching this video right now, that means that you know deep down you know this man he'll never marry you he'll never commit to you he never put a ring on you he'll never claim you in public you are his dirty little secret but you need assurance you need somebody to tell you the harsh truth and i'm nima speaks right i speak my mind nima is gonna tell you the truth and the truth of the matter of the fact is that you know he's no good but you want someone else to tell you so here i am here i am telling you he is a loser <laughs> i am sorry ladies you wasted your time you wasted a year six months two years three years with this man again it's no time wasted you learned a lesson and that lesson is that this man will never commit to you there's too many red flags that you have ignored in the past but nima speaks your big sister your little sister nima he's here to tell you today that move the f on He's not going to marry you. Quit trying to justify and say, but, but Nima, he has been, we have been together for so long, but Nima, he, he, he like, he cares for me. He called me, but Nima, he, 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 no, babes, you're watching this video because you, deep down, you know that that man you're with right now, he'll never commit to you. And I always say it's better to be single better be single and i'm not saying the whole universe should be single it's better for you to be single than in a toxic and a relationship that's not going nowhere right you're just beating a dead horse so just move on i'm sorry i know i'm sounding like the bad guy here but i love you so much to tell you the harsh realities i feel like it's my duty <laughs> As Nima, that's why my channel is called Nima Speaks. I speak my mind. And it might be a harsh reality, harsh truth. But I feel it's my duty to tell you that. Move on. Move on. Okay? Quit trying to justify his excuses. Right? Quit trying to find reason and to make this seem alright when you know it's not. When you know this relationship is not going to go nowhere, right? You may have been together for so long, but it doesn't matter. Go watch my video on the marriage panel, ladies, where they were talking about how they got proposed in one to six months. And then there's somebody who had been for five years, but that was a different experience because they were young, right? But most people, when you're grown, men don't take that long to commit to you. Please love yourself enough to move on move on from this man so if you're watching this video especially if you went on youtube you search for it is my man wasting your time is he wasting your time how do i know he's wasting your time um red flag sign that my man he's just not that into me sign he'll never commit all of these titles that i'm telling you if you search this on youtube sis you are better off single you're better off single the fifth most important point is that if you search for this video, you already know the answer.
move on. He wasted your time. You allowed him. You were desperate. Fine. So, but, but it's time for you now to pack it and move on. The little grace and dignity that you have, take it with you, ladies. I love you. That's how much I love you. I love you to tell you that. Comment down below. What are some other red flags and signs that this man, he's just wasting your time. He'll never commit to you. He'll never marry you. Now, as always, I got to take this time and opportunity to brag about my show, co-host a shout out to the people who are able to make today's video possible so shout out to craig rochelle mar and creative symmetry thank you guys for becoming a channel member and helping me run today's show if you'd like a shout out go ahead become a channel member and you might get a shout out in my next video and i'm so excited to announce that i was able to create a discord group for all my channel members so if you become a channel member here on youtube or you go and pledge on patreon it's the same levels if you become a channel member here on youtube or patreon you will get access to my discord group just a little thank you right for supporting me as always if you made it this far into the video let's do an emoji of the day please do the you know the red dress dancing emoji girl do that emoji to show you know what nima i'm gonna move on to my life so i know that you watch this video all the way through but please go ahead hit that like button hit the subscribe button comment on today's video share this video if you hated this video go ahead dislike it you know what i mean i am mad at you so i know that there's actually people who are watching my videos now as always ladies na sana.